In today's English lesson, you will learn some phrasal verbs that use the word turn. Let's get started. Don't miss a lesson. Click the red subscribe button, then click the bell. Hello, Real Fluency friends. I'm Trisha, and I'm here to teach you real English used in real life so that you can reach real fluency now. And today, I will teach you some phrasal verbs that use the word turn. And this will be part one of two videos, two lessons, because there are a lot of phrasal verbs that use the word turn. Number one, turn up or turn down. This can mean to change the volume of something to be either louder, up or softer, down. Or to change something like sound, heat or light, or some other electronic equipment such as a heater or a furnace. A sample sentence is, please turn down the TV. It's too loud and it's driving me crazy. There was also a song by a band named Autograph that was called Turn Up the Radio. If I can find it on YouTube, I'll put a link to the video in the description. Turn down can also mean to not accept an offer, such as for a date or a job. A sample sentence is, I can't believe he turned down the job offer from SpaceX. It would be so cool to work there. Turn down can also mean to fold the edge of something, usually used when talking about sheets or a blanket on a bed for someone to get ready to sleep in. As in, the hotel maid already had our beds turned down. Turn up can also mean to appear or to be someplace or to find something, as in, I don't know what I did with that book, but I'm sure it will turn up eventually. Or, he was late for the meeting, but finally turned up. Turn on or off means to start an electronic device or light, like to turn it on or to stop one, turn off. Sample sentences, Please turn off the lights when you leave so you don't waste energy. To turn on or off can also mean to make someone feel attracted to you or to not be attracted to you or to cause them to become interested in something or to not like something. Some sample sentences are, when he talks about physics and his rockets, he really turns me on. Or, I was really turned off by the way she brags about all of her accomplishments all of the time. Turn on can also mean to suddenly become violent or angry and is used a lot with uh, talking about the behavior of wild animals. A sample sentence is, even though he raised a lion since it was born, one day it just turned on him and attacked him. Turn in and turn out. Turn in can mean to give something to someone, as in the teacher told the students to turn in their homework. It can also mean to tell the police about someone who has committed a crime, as in she turned him into the police because she knew he had stolen the car. It can also mean to go to bed, as in it's really late, I need to turn in, but I have to finish recording this video first. Turn out can mean to have something happen in a certain way or be found out, as in, I'm very worried, but I hope it turns out okay. It can also mean pretty much the same as turn off when talking about lights, like, let's turn out the lights now. It can also mean for people to go to a place or an event, usually a large number of people, as in millions of people turned out to protest the president. Or it can mean to make someone leave a place, for example, their home, like they were turned out of their home when they couldn't pay the rent. Turn in and turn out can also mean to be, to point or be directed inward, turn in, or directed outward to turn out, turn in, turn out. Okay, now it's time for a short quiz. So fill in the blanks with either turn up, turn down, turn on, turn off, turn in, or turn out. Number one, the blank for the concert was really amazing. Number two, I can't hear the TV, can you blank it blank? 
Number three, she blank the job offer because it didn't pay enough. Number four, she was blank by the bad smell in the restaurant and didn't want to eat anything. The answers are at the very end of this video, so please keep watching so you can see what the right answers are. Also, please leave a comment. You can try answering the quiz questions in a comment, or you can try making your own sentences with any of the words that we learned in this lesson, or just any comment you want to leave at all, or any English you want to practice. Write some sentences or whatever, and I will give you some feedback on your English. That's all for today's lesson. So please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done that yet. I would really appreciate it. And you can also, if you want, sign up to get some emails to get more English help from me. And if you have the time, watch more of my English lessons here on YouTube. Goodbye. And remember, with hope, anything is possible. Number one, the blank for the concert was really a uh, Number four, she was Blank by the bad smell in the cap in the bath. Number one, turn up or turn down. Um, these can be, oh, I don't like that at all. The answers at the, ah.